Hello everyone, AJ Zambanini, Drying Product Manager here at Conair. And I wanted to talk to you a little bit about our DX Mobile Dryers. So if you guys are familiar with our D-Series Desk and Wheel Dryers, you'll be familiar with these DX Dryers. These Mobile Series Dryers combine a D-Dryer with a hopper on a common cart. What's really cool about a Mobile Dryer is that you can actually include conveying right on the system. So it's basically an all-in-one material handling package. If you get the premium control package, you can actually load the hopper and then load the machine right from the dryer itself. So this reduces the need for any internal infrastructure to be able to do what you need to do in drying plastic. It's fully mobile, it's on casters, you can bring it to where it is needed in your facility. These mobile dryers are sized from about 15 pounds an hour up to about 200 pounds an hour, just so you can still move them around easily throughout your facility. What you'll notice about the hopper that we include on the cart itself is that it has a nice stainless steel outside, clean look and finish, and also stainless steel contact points on the inside. Integrated right on the hopper is a full level sight glass, so you can see what is in the hopper and how much is in the hopper. On this door glass as well is a track, so you can actually include a remote demand sensor to change the level of the material in the hopper should you have a job that's a little bit smaller than the dryer that you have on hand. Opening up the drying hopper is very easy using these no knuckle busting latches. Very easy to open and you'll notice a very open area in order to get in there and do clean outs as you change these things over. That's what they're intended for, being used for what you need at the time. So you could be drying black material today and yellow material tomorrow and it's still very easy to clean out the dryer. Internal to the drying hopper, is our diffuser cone. This is what spreads air out inside the hopper. As you'll notice, I removed it fully from the hopper, again, to make this system very easy to clean out. What's a little bit different about a con air drying system is that we have two places where the air actually diffuses. The majority of the air here out of the bell section, and then the other remainder of the air out of the bottom in this drop tube. The reason being is we wanna make sure that the material is dry all the way down in the cone section. So when you start your system, your material is ready from the first shot on. Just like on our D-series dryers, we try to make these things easy to clean out and easy to operate. So you'll notice that all the filters are located conveniently on the front. Your regeneration filter here, your process air filter next to it, and then if you have onboard conveying, the conveying filter down here at the bottom. This makes the system very easy to clean out and maintain. Again, just like all of Conair controls, the DX dryer follows our unified control platform. So available in two packages, the Plus and the Premium, you can get a four inch controller, or like you see here on this DX25, a seven inch premium controller. The premium controller gives you a larger touch area in order to interact with the screen, but it also comes with more features. If you wanna be able to load the hopper and load the machine, you'll need a premium control package. This makes it easier to navigate, but puts all your features in one spot. The 4 inch plus control is very easy to operate and puts just what you need at your fingertips. If you're used to push buttons and LCD screens, then the 4 inch control is probably just what you need. Conveying to the hopper can actually be done using ratio as well, so you can feed material from a grinder or a second source, as well as virgin material from a box. Conveying out to the machine, however, is done in a closed loop conveying circuit, so we can try to keep that material dry from the minute that it leaves the hopper until the minute that it enters the machine throw. One really cool advantage of the Conair DX series dryers is that from 15 all the way up to 200 pounds an hour, you can get the optional air-cooled aftercooler. Now, all Conair dryers, as you might remember, come with an aftercooler, typically water-cooled. This allows these dryers to dry from 150 to 375 degrees as standard, right out of the box, no extra equipment. But if you opt for the air-cooled aftercooler, it adds to the mobility of your system. You no longer are tied to a place in your facility where you have water drops available. That means if you wanna pre-dry this system out in the hallway and get it ready for your next job, you no longer have to find a place where you have water to cool off the dryer. The internal air-cooled after-cooler will handle that. So as long as you have power, you're ready to roll. Just like all of the new DCB controls, this dryer is capable of using its onboard VNC viewer, which allows you to actually log into this dryer remotely for viewing or control. It's virtually a mirror of the control that you'd be standing in front of. But you can take it one step further if you're 
interested in Conair Smart Services Industry 4.0 system, and you can actually tie this system right to the cloud for data process and analysis in the future. So whether you're new to drying or plastics processing, or you're a large facility that just needs greater flexibility, the DX Mobile Dryer is the right fit for you.